Welcome back. You're still locked to Tea Time on Plus TV Africa. The entertainment don't stop and won't stop. As said earlier, we are of our worst behavior. And next, we have two very good bad guys who are musically diverse. And this has been evident in their work. Mobad and Fabian Blue. Hey. What's good, guys? Welcome What's up, guys. man? What's good? Mm -hmm. How's it going? All right, so Mobad is popular for his most re recent record, which is Pomo right now. Mm -hmm. Yes, but like we were supposed to play that video, but it's not a morning vibe. What inspired mm -hmm. that song? <laughs> Without being too explicit, please. What <laughs> <laughs> yeah. inspired this song? Pomo. Well, Pomo. You know what Pomo means now? Mm -hmm. No, I don't know what Pomo means. Pomo was inspired by Pomo. Yes, Pomo was inspired by Pomo. Yeah. <laughs> then when you mix it with like... Pepe, Toma Yimata. Yes, no, there was a day uh, I just... Yeah, I, I'm getting into it. Let me see. Pomo's a PG, please. Is it Pomo the meat? Like the yes, no, that's what I'm okay, talking about, yeah. No, you can see me using a music too, right? video. I actually don't like Pomo. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right. Pomo. And Fabian Blue has the each record um, Instagram. And that has, yeah, what inspired that as well, Instagram? Um... Actually, Instagram wasn't inspired by anything, though. I actually brought out the vibe, and I was like, let me just flow with it that way. And that was just it. And I had to put more bad and narrow the song mm. to just flow with it. So it wasn't like it was inspired by anything. But do you think like Instagram puts a lot of pressure on you, and um, you have the, the constant need to keep up? Do you mean Instagram, like social media? Yeah, social media. Or the song? No, social media. Mm. Social media, Instagram. Yeah. Mm. Mm, doesn't. Um, I'm still. I'm still on this learning process. You understand? I'm upcoming. I'm just trying to be there. You mm. understand? So I'm not really stressing anything mm. now. I'm allowing the flu. I like that. Um, the earlier conversation we had with your first lady, she mentioned that it felt like a family and all of that. Obviously, you guys are young gains doing your mm, thing. Yeah. Um, do you really feel the same way? As in, like, that there is that family and you have a sense of security to go through this industry without, you know, meeting the wrong type of people? That's for you. No, our team, you, as you said earlier, family. Mm. So we are not scared at all. We are, like, we are supporting each other mm. when we need the support. So we believe with time, everyone is going up. So right. my answer to the word, you know. I that. respect that. All right, there's this general perception that the general public has about Malians. You know, when they hear mm. Malians, they think of dropouts, people that are on drugs, people <laughs> yeah. that are up to no good and all that. Uh, yeah. How do you guys deal with that? Because I've met you guys and I know you guys are men of integrity mm. from yeah. my standpoint so how do you guys deal with that a lot of you guys are educated you've been to school but people mm. just see it and like um, naira mali said 99 percent of malians are not on social media they're on mm. the streets and all that so do you think you guys are passing across the wrong message for the street guys and you're not actually setting a good example for them or do you think that people just need to set their own record straight uh, you know from when you say when you want to get a monkey, you act like a monkey. Mm. We are from a good family, from a good home. Mm. But doing our music from our words, mm. we are passing our messages. Mm. Mm. So with that, I'm not my boy, my boy, you know, now mm. we can't force anybody. Mm. Even Nero, as I said earlier, Nero said, mm. you have to be yeah. educated. So people that are listening, listening to it. I know you have something to say too. Yeah. Right. Uh, well, basically, I think Malia should be a new sponge follower. Mm. Of Namali's, Namali's belief, mm. or so uh, Namali's belief songs and everything, but um, Malian has, has their own classes. Mm. Mm. You know, there's levels. There are levels. <laughs> <laughs> Malians have the <laughs> levels. Yeah. We, have, we have the corporate Malian, mm. we have the soft Malian, mm. we have the rugged Malian, we have the cool Malian. We have soft Malians. I like that one. Like me, I'm the. Yeah, soft Malian. Can't put soft Malian. Okay. How about you? What, what, what Malian are you? <laughs> Great A Malian. Don't worry, I won't tell you. I won't tell you. So Malian, 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 Malian has, they have, mm. Malian have the classes in style too. So what's your message to the people out there that have that wrong um, impression about Malians? What's your message to them? Um, well, 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 what I would say is this. Um, you can't... You can't, um, how would I say this? There's a word for it. You can't, you can't. Oh, say it in Yoruba. No, no, I'm not Yoruba. He's not Yoruba boy. Yeah, that's the name of Yoruba boy. Right. Um, a Malian should be identified 
by who he is mm. and not what he thinks their he values and standards. Yeah, yeah. Mm. 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 He should be identified by who he is and not, not what, what you think he should be. Yes, right. So not what the public is expecting yes. of you. Right. Not be you define and be your own mind. Yeah. Right. Exactly. Do you think oh, this opportunity that you guys have been signed to um, somebody like Malia, who's obviously really respected, especially with his lyrics and stuff and his musical talent. Do you think that that type of clout that you guys are on is genuinely beneficial or is it just empty clout? No, it's not oh, empty clout. Yeah. No, no, no. Like you said, Malians, we are family. Mm. You understand? So we're all benefiting from it. Uh, we know every, each other and... Each, uh, we know everything going on. Like, mm -hmm. Fabian knows where Nera is right now. Like, mm. your family, your mm. friends. So, there is love everywhere. So, with the love, yeah. What you're trying to say the other time is going to find, find, find. Mm. You know now. Exactly. Alone. What's the biggest <laughs> lesson you've learned from Naramali? Okay. Naramali is just Naramali. Do you know why? Me, when I was, before I was signed, so I always, like, I look up to people. I believe when I work with this, that is when I'm going to blow. Like, mm. if I don't feature this artist, yeah, I can't blow up. Mm. But when you get to a point, working with him, like, he, le he let me believe yeah, you can do this. Yeah. You can make your own singles and go out mm -hmm. there. So, mm. me working with him is just like, he had up to me. Like, we are in the same line of music. Mm. So, me now, I'm just working towards yes. what he's doing. And I know I'm going to a good place because he's not even stopping, you know, now. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. How about you? What's the biggest lesson you learned from Naramali? Uh, Naramali has a strategy. Naramali is different from what people see him as he is. Mm. He actually has a different background from what people used to see mm -hmm. on TV. Mm. You know? I've learned a lot from Naramali. I've learned a lot from Naramali. I've learned a lot. As an upcoming, as an upcoming artist from Naramali, I've learned a lot. Mm. Stuff like um, knowing my placement, mm. um, knowing the kind of impression I portray to people outside. Mm. Nice. You understand? So little things like that I've learned and I wish to learn more from him. All right, real quick, just tell your yeah. um, fans what, what they should be expecting yeah. from you and what you yeah. guys are up to. Yeah, to me, I will speak louder now because uh. my EP is coming to, yeah. You know, my EP is coming this year. So, mm. as you sure now, nobody never disappoints. All my fans know that one for real. Mm. So, I got seven tracks coming. So, spread the unexpected and I have different artists. Or by Molle. Give this us year, names year, of booking like No, no, I won't like, I won't like to do you that. People, you Malians don't actually spill any discreet. tea. How yeah. about what you? About you? What, what should your fans be expecting? If Malians are discreet, what would you think I am? <laughs> 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 well, you should be expecting something from something, me. Something, no, no. Mm. Something from me, yeah. But I won't say the date, but something this This year. This year. Okay, this so year. look out to all that obviously will be on all streaming platforms. Yep. And we'll get the information from your social media. Standard yeah. procedure. All right. Hey, for people that think Malians are all you about boys, it's from Cross River by the way. I was yeah. no, right. But I you were it. laughing too much, Yoruba. That's why. I can't I can't speak Yoruba fluently, but I hear Yoruba. Yeah, because I saw you were laughing to his and I didn't even understand the Yoruba, the heavy Yoruba he spoke. So I thought that ah, okay, you speak no, Yoruba. No, okay. Uh, okay, so That's like cool. family. But you're going to know Okpo, Okpo, Okpo. Yeah, yeah, Okpo. yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> All righty, it's been fun chatting with you guys, yeah. So we'll catch up with you guys. Oh. Tea time needs to go on another quick break and we will be right back. Stay with us.